Hi, sweet friends. So today I'm going to take this dining room from Christmas to winter. And I believe I'm going to be using the snowman and I'm going to go in the restroom and get my red birds and bring them in here. So snowmen and red birds and we're going to make a little change. Here is the dining room, a buffet. So not too many changes needed in this area, but we will see if we can't do a little transformation here as well. So I'm gonna go in the restroom and get my red birds from there. Here are the items that I have taken out of the dining room to make way for the new winter decor. I started to take the ribbon off of the tree and I will be replacing that with a, a snowflake ribbon. I love those beautiful poinsettias. There's my big Santa hat that I had on the top of the tree. I stuff it full of um, grocery bags to give it some fluff, some, um, yeah, fluff. I don't know what else to call it. So we're gonna get started decorating in the dining room for winter time. So I've started taking apart the Christmas tree. I have removed the ribbon here, um, the red truck ribbon, and I will be replacing it with this ribbon. And so we'll get that done. I took the non-snowman things off of the shelves. Here are the items that I believe I may be incorporating. This snowman is actually one of the large, large Christmas bags from the Dollar Tree. I taped it onto a frame, picture frame that I already had. And um, I think it turned out really nice. Here's the back side of it, nothing fancy, and it fit perfectly, so I wanna incorporate that snowman. Here's a really pretty winter scene that I got at Hobby Lobby after Christmas at 90% off, so for three bucks. I think I want to use these metal chargers. They look kind of frosty to me, so I may incorporate those. I'll be using these placemats. I need to make a new little sign to cover up the barbecue pig on the black truck. I took the red bird items out of the restroom and I'll be incorporating those. This red bird here was painted by one of my aunts and I just love to bring it out. I'll be using the napkins again, but I will be incorporating these napkin rings that I got at Hobby Lobby after Christmas. The little gold basket that I got at Dollar Tree. Only bad thing is my snowballs have turned red from sitting on the red and gold shred that I had in the, the bowl that they were in. There's my Lucite candles. Not sure if I will be using those or not, but here's my more wintry trees that I'll probably incorporate here. So I'm gonna get started and see how it goes. I'll bring y'all back after I'm done. Okay, I have the final walkthrough of my dining room. I have it decorated in a winter decor and I thought I would show y'all around and show y'all how I have it decorated. This is my first time to decorate for winter. Normally I have gone straight from Christmas to Valentine's, but this year I thought I would try my hand at winter decorating. So I will start here on my dining room table. I've included this cardinal plate. This is by Avon I picked it up at the thrift store and I have it um, backed with a silver plate with the melamine handles or not melamine, but Bakelite handles. So I thought that just helps the plate stand out. I kept the red buffalo plaid from Christmas. 
have an itty bitty teeny tiny little cardinal right there. I incorporated these um, like boa napkin rings. They're white and fluffy for winter time. A little dish with some silver balls and a tree, a green tree with some snow. A brass pedestal with snowballs. I kept my black truck and added some different colored trees. And behind it is a tinsel tree in a princess house bowl with some silver balls. So that's the way I have the table set up. I kind of pared it down a little bit from Christmas. I kept up the hearth in hand ivy wreaths on my china cabinet with the red buffalo plaid ribbon. Here is the Christmas tree that I left up. I have snowmen and cardinals on here. White bows. I have holly. I changed out my ribbon for a more wintry-ish. I did not have the ribbons that I would have liked to use. So that is one of the things I will be on the, the lookout for is some wintry type ribbon that I can use. So I used what I had and um, it's it's great. I have purchased these little birds at Target, 90% off. There's several of them throughout the tree. Another type of snowman. And I just had a little bit of fun with it. Here's a picture that I got at the Dollar Tree. There's snow a place like home. The bow is a little weak at the top, but I tell you guys, I just did not have ribbon that was per se wintry. I had a lot of ribbon that was Christmas, so I'm going to be on the lookout for that. And then a red bird that I picked up at Dollar Tree a long time ago. But here it is, just a little, a little something that I put together. I do really like this mesh, silver mesh ribbon that I got at the Dollar Tree. It's very thin and it is easy to work with. And I really like that. They also had sold it in gold and I used the gold on my main Christmas tree. Things here on my buffet. I kept it a lot the same. And I added this snowman pitcher. Just give it a little pop of color over here on the, the buffet. Everything else is the same. So I hope you have enjoyed this little tour and tree put together with me. If you have, please give me a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button. Become part of my friends here on YouTube. And y'all have an amazing day. See you in my next video. Bye.